I realized it was her. It's just the bottom fell out, really very upsetting. John Duran of Westbury says the suspicious death of his neighbor Haley Anderson robbed this world of a compassionate, charismatic 22-year-old who was just getting her start as a health care professional. Friday, she was found dead in this home near Binghamton University where she was enrolled in the nursing program. That city's police detectives are not saying anything about what killed the college student, but classified it a homicide. Detectives are looking to talk to a man, also a nursing student, who they say Anderson was romantic with, but they're not calling him a suspect. They say he left the country before the body was discovered. It's so terrible. And my heart bleeds for the family. Anderson's mother and younger sister live in this Westbury house, which became crowded with supportive neighbors, friends, and relatives. We were told family members are too distraught to talk about this loss and the mysteries surrounding it. Oh, it's hard to understand, you know. Before going off to college, she worked at this shop, walking distance from her home, selling Italian ices and ice cream. Her younger sister worked here, too. This is not an easy loss at all. Emma Durbin's a longtime friend who met Anderson when she started working in the same shop. She was literally like the greatest person ever. She never like didn't have a smile on her face. This year uh, she did an internship at a hospital here on Long Island and she told me about all the operations that, that she witnessed. Tragic loss. For many here, not knowing the how or the why of this homicide case haunts them. They want anyone responsible for this to be identified and brought to justice. In Westbury, Nassau County, Dave Carlin, TV 1055.